much as we all feel the rain today, I feel the fire. I feel the fire that these 48 hours always seems to produce year after year after year. Energy in the air, raging strong, usually revolutionary. This following piece was written Tuesday, April 30th, 2013 at 11.54 p.m. Completed Wednesday, May 1st, 2013, 12.04 a.m. As secure as we are told to be, insecurity prevails. It's not about who we're being protected from as much as the ones who are doing the job. Are they on our side? We feel more like victims to be taxed and taken advantage of and deemed guilty for any made up infraction. We need to trust at a time when vulnerable, but we're given no reason to. We need to open up and show love but our imposed stresses bind us down. We need to freely express ourselves, but the laws bind us down. We need our military and leaders to be there for what is supposedly us, but they're not really ours. Tuesday, May 1st, 2012, 11.59 p.m. The warmth of yet another summer begins its seasonal domination, but heat of another sort is rising faster. Winter wasn't enough to exterminate it, and now it's set to burst in the fields. These pastures are ones of societal structure. Revolutionary energy is what I'm referring to, and the people creating it have a goal of disruption. It's needed to gain attention and support in their battle of taking down the nemesis. Their chances of success are nearly nil. It's as if all is being done to reveal a collapse of the fundamental foundation our nation sprouted from. The grand architects of yesteryear would erupt with rage in seeing what their creation has grown into. Laws are flying from the hill to points where few are innocent in the land of the free. Amongst the crumbling infrastructure, pristine, overly efficient deten detention centers already rise. Is what has been foreseen coming to be? A constitutional collapse is on the horizon, given away to a totalitarian state that will eliminate even dreams had while living the nightmare. Who takes control is insignificant. Such a being is only a puppet. All of them have different moves, but the master, he never changes. Reveal yourself, you ancient serpent. How much strength can you have if there's always a need to remain anonymous? Thank you. Whoa.